What's up guys, welcome back. Leo here, full-time foodie, full-time eater. We're putting in overtime this week. We're here late night and I'm joined today by my wife. Hola, soy Ingrid. Today we're at a boba spot here in Orlando, Florida. It's called Mogi Tea. We've tried a bunch of boba spots down here. In our opinion, this is the best spot down here. There might be a few stragglers that we haven't gotten to yet, but we eventually will. We kind of got burned out after a couple bad experiences in a row. We're from New York, so we had some amazing boba. We've tried Tiger Sugar and Chin Fu Tang. And the reason why those spots are top tier is that they make their bobas fresh. If you stop in at the right time at Chin Fu Tang in Flushing, New York, you could catch them making their bobas fresh. And it's really amazing. If you're looking to level up your foodie game, you definitely have to visit them. I'm hungry, so we're gonna have to get some food. I'm also thirsty. All right, so let's head in, let's drink. They have an awesome menu starting with cheese foam fruit teas, regular fruit teas, fruit yakult, I'm not sure what that is. They even sell parfaits. They have cheese foam with tea, of course the bubble teas, and the famous brown sugar boba. They even have coffee. Plenty of toppings to add on. Herbal jelly, lychee jellies, creme brulee. We got two that are our favorites and two that the owner recommended. He recommended one that's a mango pomelo, we've never had, and also a lemon oolong fruit tea. So we're gonna try those out for the first time. All right, so when you get it like this, you gotta mix it up. Mix it up, mix it up good so you get all that caramel flavor. All right, let's taste it. I'm trying to talk here, <laughs> but chewing the bovas, you know, they takes a little time. Mm -hmm. It's like a gummy bear. The milk with the brown sugar syrup, it's amazing. It has a great flavor. If you love caramel, this is why I always get this one, because I love caramel. <laughs> this is a taro milk tea. So this is something unique that I've never seen at another boba spot. They have like a sweet mashed up taro that uh, they scoop up and, and put it in here. And we also added double creme brulee because we got it one time with one creme brulee and the creme brulee was amazing. It's a nice little pudding. It's actually, it was my wife's idea and now it's my favorite too. So every time we come here, we get this one as well. Let me taste it. Mm -hmm. Wow, I love that taro flavor. Delicious. And you get a little creme brulee in there. This is the best idea ever. I've never seen it anywhere else, and it's amazing. You gotta try it. You gotta try it. This cute bubble tea right here with like little cat ears. This is the mango pomelo. I've never had this. It has cheese foam in it. All right, I see the fruit at the bottom here, so I'm gonna give it a little bit of a mix. I've tried a cheese foam boba before, but it kind of tasted like sour. I don't know if it was like just a place, it was old or, and then I've never ordered it ever again anywhere else. 
for that reason. But let's see, let's see how it is. Mm. Oh, what? Wow. Wow, wow, wow. They got some amazing creations here. Mm. I like the mango. It's cut fresh, tastes fresh. The cheese foam, it's, it's nice and sweet, not too sweet. It's not sour. So I think I had, I had cheese foam at the wrong spot. I think I got a new favorite. <laughs> oh man, I'm bumping the taro boba off the list here. <laughs> we got the fruit tea, last but not least. I'm excited for this one. I've had fruit teas before, but I've never tried it here at uh, Mogi Tea. I sort of put in watermelon, I think, I think lime and lemon slices, and maybe oranges. I don't really remember. Mm. Wow, that's refreshing. This is amazing. I like this one. You know, you go to a restaurant and you want an iced tea? This is really what you wanted. So make sure you get this one too. Me gustó este más. Tiene mango fresco y la crema es dulcita. Por eso este es mi favorito. All right, guys, we're done here. We had some amazing bobas today. As I said, this is the best spot in our opinion. The owner and the staff, super friendly. They didn't charge us for anything. We tried to at least pay for one item so we could leave a tip in the card. He wouldn't have any of it. I really appreciate it. We're definitely gonna have to come back tomorrow because of course, we're gonna be thirsty tomorrow. <laughs> That's all I have. Don't forget to eat, drink, and be merry.